<laughs> Go, Buster! You're looking very cheerful today, Buster. What's that you've seen? Oh, wow! A kitten! It's adorable! Careful, Buster. You're really big, and the cat is really small. Oh, dear. I think you scared her, Buster. I wonder where she's going. You're too big to go under the fence, Buster. You'll have to go around. Where's that kitten gotten to? Uh-oh. She's stuck up in that tall tree. You've got to rescue her, Buster. A trampoline? What a good idea! That'll be a nice soft landing for the kitten. Bounce? Oh no! The kitten bounced right the way back up into the tree. Let's try something else. A net? Good idea, Buster. Careful now. Gently. Gently. Oh look, a bee! Stay still, Buster. I don't think he means any harm, but... Oh dear. The net is broken too. Back to the drawing board. Hold on. I think Buster has another idea. Of course! Buster's brought Ashley the fire truck. She'll be able to reach the kitten with her tall ladder. There we go. <laughs> the kitten will be safe now. Oh no, I think the kitten is too scared to come down the ladder. I wonder what Buster has planned. Oh yes, the kitten's ball of wool. She'll come down to play with that. Look how happy the kitten is. Here she comes down the ladder. There, safe and sound. Nice work, Buster. <laughs> Buster, what's wrong? My tooth. Oh. It's wobbly. And it feels weird. Oh, Buster. The tooth will fall out on its own. But when? Uh... Soon. And when it does fall out, if you put it under your pillow, the tooth fairy will bring a coin. A gold coin? Uh, sure. You just have to be patient. <laughs> really soon. I just need to be patient. Uh, Buster? And when I put it under my pillow, the Tooth Fairy will bring a gold coin. Buster. Hmm. I wonder what she needs the teeth for. Buster! What? Your tooth! It's already gone! Huh? <gasps> no! My tooth! It's gone! When did you last have it? I don't remember. It could be anywhere. And if I can't find it, I can't put it under my pillow. This is so bad! Wait, Buster. We can find it ourselves! You mean, like detectives? That's right, Detective Buster. The case of the missing tooth! Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> nope. I haven't seen your missing tooth. Are you sure? I'm sure. Super duper turbo sure. Then what's that? Huh? Huh? Relax, Speedy. It's just my mint-tastic bubble gum. Huh? A tooth. Yeah, I've seen a tooth. You have? <laughs> sure. <laughs> Look. <laughs> <sighs> Detective Buster. Look! Hmm? Ha! <laughs> uh. huh? huh? Wait, this isn't a tooth. You found my eraser! Hmm. Hooray! I'm sorry, Buster. Guess we'll never solve the case. Hooray! The case!
This is solved! Nice one, Buster! <laughs> Time's up! I'm really looking forward to seeing all of your science projects. Uh, I will start off with the rainbow water experiment. Uh, but wait, what are we all missing, class? Uh, hmm. I miss huh? my mum! <laughs> uh, goggles? That's right, Buster! Goggles! <laughs> Whoa! What is it? Uh, that's my lunch buster. Hmm, this isn't rainbow coloured. Well, I look forward to seeing your experiments after break time. Hopefully with more success than mine. <laughs> Whoa! Your rocket looks super cool, Bandit! I know! Your volcano is pretty cool too, I guess. When I pour this vinegar into the volcano, it will erupt! Uh... Uh-oh! My electric rocket! Oh! <gasps> the rocket is so powerful! It's taking the lunch to outer space! Hmm, those batteries did look quite big. After that rocket! I'll get it, Buster! Look out! It's Speedy Scout! Jump on your side when I say go. Ready? Are you sure about this? No. Ah! Huh? Sorry. I thought you said go. That's not good. Uh. Oh. <laughs> Whew. Uh, Buster. <gasps> Quick! We need to block the crater! The sun! Ash! <gasps> that was close. <gasps> that was amazing! Whose project was that? Uh, everyone's. We did it together. But you'll have to clean it up, I'm afraid. And I'm going to eat my sandwich. Hmm. I don't really like rocket in my sandwiches. Hey there, Buster. Oh, what's that? A soccer ball. Huh? Oh, look, Buster. All of your friends are lined up to play a soccer game. And they need one more player. Go on, Buster. This is going to be so much fun. Kick off. Aw, <laughs> oh, too slow, Buster. <laughs> CJ, the cement mixer, is going for a shot. Can Jesse Jeep save it? Come on, Jesse, you can do it. Oh, nearly, but goal! Nice shooting, CJ. Great header, Buster. What a kick, Scout. Great block, Digger. <laughs> Scout has played the ball of Digger. Scout's making a run for the goal. Go, Scout, you can do it. No one can tackle her. Goal! Way to go, Scout. Jesse to Scout. Scout kicks it on. Great kick, Digger, straight to Bandit. Oh, that was a bit rough, Bandit. Is Bandit going to score? Can Jesse save it this time? Oh, no, Jesse burst the ball. Is that the end of the game? <laughs> oh, thank goodness. Otis has a spare ball. The game's back on. It's really heating up now. Buster's going for a run at the goal. Oh, no. Bandit bus shoved Buster. That's a foul. Good referee, Robin. Bandit's been given a red card. Robin's sending Bandit off. That's what happens when you play too rough. Now Buster gets to take a penalty shot. Come on, Buster. Goal! You did it, Buster! <laughs> you won the game! And you won a nice trophy, too! That was so much fun!
<laughs> Space. This is our solar system. Space is so cool. I brought my alien today. This is Mercury, the orange planet, Neptune, the blue planet, and Saturn, the yellow planet, with a ring. And this is Mars, the red planet. It's our nearest neighbor. I want to go to Mars. <laughs> Good for you, Buster. Reach for the stars. The first bus to put wheels on Mars. <laughs> <laughs> Watch out for those asteroids, Buster! Uh, oh. Oh. <laughs> Space is awesome! I wish we could go up there! It's Super Buster! Flying through space like a rocket! And Speedy Scout! Zooming across the universe like a... Um, <laughs> car! Come on, let's explore space! <laughs> What's up, little alien dude? Bleep, 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 bloop, 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 beep, boop! Oh, gee, that's a real sad story. Wait, you can understand what he's saying? Of course! Alien says they're lost. So we need to help them find their way home. To Mars! The Red Planet. You got it, Scout. Let's go! <laughs> Not this one. The blue planet is Neptune. Blue, blue. That's Neptune in alien language. <laughs> if I was an alien, I would live here. Woohoo! <laughs> This is Saturn. Bloop, bloop. Yeah, that's what I said. Look out, Scout! Asteroids up ahead. Hang on, little buddy. This could get bumpy. <gasps> <Ooh. laughs> Woohoo! Go, Alien! Mars, the red planet. Blue. We made it! There's your home! <laughs> Blue. Blue. <laughs> that was fun! It's time for the annual nature race, which Daddy Bus has organized. This is going to be so much fun! Ash and Buster are going to work together. They need to race through the woods as fast as they can. And the first one back gets the shiny trophy. Get set, go, go, go! Bandit has overtaken Buster and Dash. He really wants to win. What is he up to? <gasps> He's changed the sign. So Buster and Ash are going the wrong way. Oh no! Huh? There's no more path. This can't be right. And what's that? A huge tire print. Ash thinks it must be a monster. <laughs> nope, don't worry, Ash. Monsters aren't real. Uh-oh, I think they're lost, but they need to keep going. They're slowing down. Oh dear, they're stuck in the mud. What are they going to do? <gasps> what is that? It sounds like a m monster. Ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Don't worry, it's just a monster truck. And they're very friendly. She's pulling Ash out of the mud. Wow, she's strong. And now it's Buster's turn. This monster truck is called Mira. She's lost too, just like them. Buster says they can work as a team. There's Naughty Bandit. He's almost at the finish line. But look, Buster and his friends are ahead. 
And they ended up taking a shortcut. <laughs> <laughs> Hooray! Mira won the race! But she couldn't have done it without her new friends! And she's won the trophy! Yippee! But Mira feels sad for Bandit being on his own! She knows what that feels like! Bandit feels bad for cheating in the big race! Don't worry, Bandit. There's no need to cheat when you have friends by your side. And it's always fun to make new friends. It's a brand new day, and it's time for Buster to head off to school. There's Diggly. They can go to school together. They're going to race to school. Whoosh! I wonder who will be fastest. Whoa! There's a little duckling in the road. He should be more careful. Ooh. There's a mommy duck. She's trying to cross the road with her ducklings. But look out! Here comes Terry. Here comes the teacher, too. Oh, no! Phew! Thanks to Diggly and Buster, the duck family can cross the road safely. Aw, they're going to swim in that pond. Uh-oh, that duckling is walking back to the road. <laughs> Good job, Buster. Now the ducks are going back over the road. Buster and Diggly are helping them cross safely. Mommy duck is crossing too. Well done everyone for helping. But Terry and the teacher want to get moving or they'll be late. Wait a minute. I think Buster has an idea. Hmm, what are they doing with those paints? White lines? And some signs. It's a duck crossing. Now the duck family can cross the road safely whenever they like. There's the teacher again. He's telling them to hurry up. The kids had better get to school or they'll be late. Nice work, everyone. <laughs> oh, hey, it's Buster the bus. I wonder what he's doing sitting on top of that snowy mountain. Whoa, Buster is speeding down the mountain. Look at him go. Be careful, Buster. The roads might be slippery. Hey, it's Suki, the train. She's puffing her way down the mountain. Now Suki and Buster are moving side by side. But I wonder who is going to get to the bottom of the mountain first. Buster and Suki are going to race to the bottom. Look at them go. Oh no, giant snowballs have rolled into the road. Look out, Buster. Buster's having to slow down but Suki can keep going. Now Buster has caught up with Suki. It's neck and neck. What's this? Buster and Suki are taking different ways down the mountain. Suki goes over the bridge. Buster goes under it. Suki's going as fast as she can. Look, the tracks have changed. Suki is taking a shortcut to the finish line. She's speeding into the lead. Here comes Buster, but uh-oh. Suki is almost at the finish line. Buster will need to go super fast to catch her. Wait, I think Buster has an idea. Buster has made a snowboard out of that road sign. Nice job, Buster. Look how fast he can slide down the mountain. Buster's taken the lead. Hooray, Buster came first. Suki is right behind him. What fun that was! Buster and Suki had such a great time racing down the mountain. Whoa! The frightful forest!
That's spooky. Let's explore. Next stop, Frightful Forest. I don't know, Buster. Those clouds look really dark. What if it rains? Relax, Scout. It's not going to rain. Come on, Bumper Bunch. Let's move. I've never been here before. Maybe there are monsters here. <gasps> or a secret treasure. Buster, wait up. We'll get lost. Diggly, relax. I'm a bus, remember? I know where I'm going. Guys, I don't like this place. Ash, relax. Ah. <gasps> don't worry. According to my calculations, the chances of a storm are... Nobody panic! Nobody panic! Buster, what, what do we do? do? Uh, guys, relax. Ah! We can't relax. It's pouring with rain. Uh, we need to get home now. I can find the way. Uh, I think. Whoa. Forked lightning. Not now, Diggly. Ugh. Ugh, it's so wet. I can't see where I'm going. Ugh. No! I'm out of charge. Nobody gets left behind. Come on, Scout. We'll push you. <gasps> it's a river! <gasps> The path has flooded. We're trapped. What if we sink or rust? We can get across. If we go together, we'll be strong enough. We can do this. Bumper bunch, let's move. I am a brave adventurer. <laughs> Let's get out of here. We made it! Thanks to you, Buster. Sorry I led us into the rain, but we made it back together. Well done, everyone. <laughs> <laughs><gasps> Looks like he's got an idea. Hmm. <gasps> Bandit has copied Buster's costume. They look exactly the same. He's arrived at Terry's farm looking like Buster. Hmm. <laughs> Trick or treat? Hmm. <sighs> wow, look at all those sweeties. Oh, look! Buster, Ash, and Scout have arrived. Some sweeties for Scout? Some sweeties for Ash? Hang on. Nope. Terry thinks he's already given Buster lots of sweets. But it was actually Naughty Bandit. Poor Buster. Ash and Scout like how they look in their reflections. What is that? A sweet wrapper? And another? It's Bandit eating all the sweets. Buster has a plan. Ash and Scout are pretending to think that Bandit is Buster.
Bandit is looking at himself in the reflection. Wait a second. Now there are two bandits. Bandit is a bit confused. And a bit scared. Where have the others gone? Boo! Buster's plan worked. Bandit has been caught in the act. And here's Terry with more sweets. He's confused by the two zombies. He's given them to Bandit again. But Bandit is sharing it with Buster. <laughs> what a funny mix-up. Happy Halloween! Buster and his friends are back at school. They are telling each other what they got up to over the summer. Buster is so excited to tell everyone about his shark tooth. But first, Scout is telling everyone what she got up to over the summer. This summer, I went surfing for the first time ever. It was so cool. There was this one wave I saw that was absolutely massive. But I still got to surf it without falling off. And I went so fast. Scoot, scoot. Wow, Scout told such a cool story. Huh. What's wrong with Buster? Mm. Oh, he thinks his shark tooth story won't be interesting enough after Scout's story. Buster is going to tell everyone how he got the tooth. This summer, I went exploring in the deep, dark wood. It's full of animals and monsters, but I wasn't afraid one bit. But then, I came face to face with a dinosaur! <gasps> but he had a sore oh. tooth. So I took it out for him to make him feel all better. Wait a second. That's not right. Dinosaurs are extinct. Oh dear. Bandit thinks Buster isn't telling the truth. He couldn't really meet a dinosaur, could he? Oh. All right. It's not really a dinosaur tooth. Mm. It's a shark tooth. I thought that wouldn't be mm. interesting enough. But Buster, sharks are way cooler than dinosaurs. Go Buster, tell us the story. <laughs> this summer, I was at the beach, but then I saw... Mm. No. Yes, oh. pirates are even cooler <laughs> than sharks. Yarma <laughs> Hmm. Okay, the parrot and me, we found a shark, but he had a sore tooth. So we decided to take the tooth out with a little help from a friendly little bee. We took out the sore tooth and then they played catch with it. Gotcha! <laughs> And they played on the beach all day long. What a great story! It's so much fun to use your imagination, especially with friends. It's a very blustery day on the farm. Look, I think Terry has something he wants to show Buster. Hey, it's Monty, the hot air balloon. He's an old friend of Terry's. Say hello, Buster. <laughs> It must be so much fun to be able to float through the air like a balloon. But, uh-oh, the wind is picking up. I hope Monty doesn't blow away. Oh no, the rope snapped. And now the wind is blowing Monty away. Quick, Buster, you've got to chase after him. Or who knows where he'll be blown off to. Monty is so high up. How will you get him down? Look, a rope. I wonder what Buster has in mind. Hurry up, guys. You've got to get ahead of Monty. What's Buster going to do? Oh, of course, a lasso. Rope him up, cowboy. Ah, so close. But Monty is still floating away. There has to be some way to rescue Monty. <gasps> oh, 
<gasps> What's Buster seeing now? It's Iggy the ice cream truck with lots of balloons. I think I know Buster's plan. Look, Buster's tied all the balloons to himself and now he's floating into the sky. Go on, Buster, you can do it. Grab hold of Monty. Almost. Almost, almost. You've got him. Well done, Buster. You saved the day. Monty looks very grateful. Ah, uh, Monty's tied up safely again now. He's not going to float away like that balloon. Nice work, Buster. There, all squeaky clean. Nice work, champ. We've got to look our best for Great Uncle Busby's lunch. He hates mess. Trust me. Oh? Hmm. Oh. <laughs> now let's get going, or we'll be late. And Buster? Uh, yeah? Stay away from those muddy puddles. Hmm. Let's use the car wash again. <laughs> I'm clean. Let's go. Oh. <laughs> I'm so excited to see Great Uncle Busby. He always has such tasty lunches. Chips and sandwiches and cheese sticks. Mmm. That's right, Buster. And carrot cake and steam buns and lemonade. Do you think you'll have blueberry muffins again? Do you, Daddy? Do you? I hope so. And peanut butter and ice cream and... Oh. Huh? Oh. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry. Hmm. Car wash again? <laughs> Hurry up, we're gonna be late. <laughs> come on, Daddy, I'll race you. Oh, yeah, here I come. <laughs> Kate! <gasps> Whoa! <gasps> oh, steaming gaskets! any moment! <laughs> we made it just in time. Well done, Buster. Thanks, Daddy. Okay. Let's go see Uncle Busby. <laughs> Sorry! Huh? <laughs> Daddy, hmm. I think you need to use the car wash. Hmm. <laughs> Buster and his friends are on a holiday at the beach. What a fun day out! Wow, the sea looks amazing! What is that in the water? Ah, it's a shark! Buster is very scared! Oops, watch out, Iggy! Mommy Bus is taking a nap on the beach. Buster is trying to tell her what he saw. It had scary fins and jumped out of the water. It was a shark. Hmm. Mommy Bus can't see anything. Don't worry, Buster. Everything is fine. And Mommy Bus is going back to her nap. Buster is still very scared. I wonder if the shark is still there. Ah, it's a shark! Go, Buster, go! 
Oops, not again! Buster is still frightened, but he wants to get over his fear. He's going back again. There's the shark. Wait a second, what's wrong? The shark has a sore, wobbly tooth. That's why it was jumping out of the water. Don't worry, shark. Buster can help. He's trying to get Mommy's attention. She's awake. She's got her red kit and Mommy Bus to the rescue. Splat! <laughs> yum, yum! Mommy Bus is removing the shark's wobbly tooth. It's out! Hooray! The shark feels so much better now. Well done, Buster! He can't wait to show the tooth to his friends. Buster is excited to spend the day with Grandpa. And Grandpa's looking at a beautiful cake. Grandpa has an idea. They should bake the cake together. Buster and Grandpa have come to the supermarket to get the ingredients. Flour, eggs, milk, and icing sugar. Boop! Who's that? It's Mira! Along with Terry. Buster rushes to get the ingredients. But Grandpa warns him not to be hasty. Buster's looking for flour. Bingo! He's found it! And so has Mira! Uh-oh! Looks like they've got the same list of ingredients. Whoa! They both want the same bag! Oops! Mira and Buster are in the race to find out who gets all the ingredients first. Buster's come to get the milk. He got it first! Off he goes, Mira! Whoops! Mira, you spooked the teacher! <laughs> she grabbed some milk, too. Slow down, you guys! Whoa! It's Grandpa and Terry! Both of them move very slowly. <laughs> you sure are smart and sly, Buster. Off they go again. Oh, look! There are the eggs! Oh, no! Buster dropped the eggs! And... Miro spotted the last bag of icing sugar. Mira sprints off to get it. But, oh no! Mira lost balance and crashed into the shelf! Buster grabs the last bag of icing sugar. But Mira's upset. Buster offers her the icing sugar. And she wants him to have it. Grandpa and Terry are surprised to see Mira in a mess. Buster's got a plan. Aw, looks like Buster and Mira shared the icing sugar to bake one big cake. The cake tastes delicious. Great teamwork, Mira and Buster. Look, it's Buster the bus. And there's Scout, the little car. They look like they're having such good fun. Buster and Scout are best friends. I think they're going to play together. Looks like Buster and Scout have gone to play at the beach. Look at all the fun the two friends are having. Scout's zooming ahead. She's very speedy. And she loves to drive around really fast. Hey there, Scout! Buster and Scout love to tease each other, like all best friends do. Wow! Nice stunt jump, Scout! Scout has an ice cream! Oh no! Buster knocked it onto the floor by accident. But wait, it's Iggy the ice cream truck! 
There we go. Two ice creams for Buster and Scout. Look, Scout, there's no need to be upset. Buster got you an ice cream. Hmm, tasty. I think Buster and Scout are having a race. Oh, look, they're all covered in sand now. That was fun, but now they'll need to get clean again. Look, it's Ashley the fire truck. I wonder if they can clean off Buster and Scout with the water hose. That's right, Buster and Scout are squeaky clean again. Thanks, Ashley. Bye bye, Buster. Bye bye, Scout. What a nice day we've had. You're it, Scout! Everybody scatter! <laughs> hey! Come back! <laughs> Catch me if you can! <laughs> I feel dizzy! <laughs> oh no! No, no, no! Huh? Uh. <gasps> My painting! Uh. No! Bandit, did you do this? What? I didn't do anything! <sighs> Buster, I didn't do anything! Buster, uh. come on! I painted you a picture to cheer you up. See? There's you, and there's the dinosaur. <sighs> Ash, whatever is the matter? My painting! Bandit smashed it with his tire! It wasn't me! I didn't do it! I promise! Is that the truth, Bandit? It's important to own up to your mistakes, uh... even if it was an accident. No, it was me who drove over Ash's painting. Oh. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. I was just driving too fast. I didn't see it. Buster, why didn't you say anything? Because I was afraid what you'd all think. I'm really sorry, Bandit. I didn't mean for you to get in trouble. I was just scared. That's OK. I forgive you. <laughs> That's very kind of you, Bandit. Buster, it's not an easy thing to own up to our mistakes. You did a very brave thing admitting the truth. <laughs> well done. Now, if you all gather round, I've got an idea of how we can make Ash's painting as good as new. <laughs> Your turn, Ash, with orange. <laughs> Yellow, green, blue. That's it, everyone. It's a rainbow. You can't even see the tire mark. Wow, it's better than before. <laughs> oh, wow. Buster's become a rocket, and he's going to space. Five, four, three, two, one. Blast off. Look at Buster go! All right! You did it, Buster! You're in outer space! What a cool place to be! I think Buster wants to go space exploring! Look at that! It's a red planet! Let's go in for a closer look! Hey there, little space buddy. I bet that alien has never seen a bus before. Where are you off to now, Buster? Oh, a yellow planet. It's so beautiful with that huge ring around it. Look at that. 
Buster's gonna go for a drive around the ring. Let's see how fast you can go. Whoa! That was fun! <laughs> What's Buster seeing now? It's a purple planet. Isn't it huge? Whoa! Round and round the planets Buster goes. Round the purple planet, the yellow planet, and the red planet. But wait! Oh no! A blue planet! Buster's going too fast! I think he's going to hit it! Oh, thank goodness! It was only a dream! You're okay, Buster. Look, Scout is using her telescope to look at the night sky. Take a look, Buster. There's the purple planet, the yellow planet, and the red planet. Hello, little space buddy! Hey, look! It's Buster the bus. He's having a day on the beach. Doesn't it look lovely? Oh no! Buster, your wheels are stuck in the sand. That wasn't part of the plan. Oh. Look at Digger. He's not getting stuck thanks to his caterpillar tracks. And who's this? Sandy the seagull. I wonder if Sandy will be able to help. I think she wants you to follow her, Buster. That's it, Buster. If you move one wheel at a time, you won't get stuck again. Digger's digging a hole. Oh, look out, Buster. What's that? A bucket and a spade? I think Sandy wants you to help her build a sand castle. Just a bit more sand. Turn it over and there, a sand castle. Well done, Buster. Isn't it pretty? Good job. Oh, wow. Digger's sand castle is amazing. It's much bigger than yours. He's, wait, Buster, look out. Mind the hole. At least Digger's here to get you out again. I think Digger's really proud of his brilliant sand castle. Oh no, Sandy, don't land there. You'll destroy the sand castle. I don't think Sandy realizes what she's doing. Oh no, it's just a big pile of sand now. And what's that noise? A wave! Watch out, guys! Poor Digger. But wait! Not all the sand castles have been destroyed. Buster's little castle is still standing. And now it's the biggest and the best, thanks to Sandy. Goodbye, everyone. Hope you had a great fun day at the beach. Hooray. It's time for the big race. Diggly, Scout, and Buster are going to race to see who wins the cup. Oh, Bandit is racing too. Ready, steady, go. And they're off. Buster's driving as fast as he can, and his wheels are going round and round. Bandit's in the lead, but Buster is passing him. Hooray! Buster's in the lead. Everyone is driving really fast. Look out! Scout is speeding ahead. Scout's taking the lead. Uh-oh, a low bridge. Little Scout can fit under, but everyone else will have to go around. Buster and Diggly have reached a river. How will they cross? Nice! Diggly made a bridge. It was a shortcut. Now they've caught up with Scout. There's Bandit. Oh no! That's an oil barrel spilling all over the road. Scout and Diggly are sliding on the oil. What a cheater. But Buster is still racing. He's catching Bandit. Bandit's skidding. He ended up in that pond. Serves him right. There's the finish line. Buster speeding ahead. Hooray! Buster won! And as his prize, he can have a nice tasty ice cream. And of course, the winner's cup. Buster is at Daddy's house today. Oh look, it's Daddy Bus. Tomorrow, Buster is going back to school. It's going to be great. But first, they need to get ready. Daddy Bus has a checklist of everything Buster needs before he goes back to school tomorrow. <laughs> he needs his rucksack, a lunchbox, his school book, a pencil case, and a ruler. Hmm. 
Rucksack? Check. Lunchbox? Check. Everything else? Check. And last but not least, the shark tooth from his holiday for show and tell. Wow! Buster needs to get a good night's sleep before school tomorrow. Good night, Buster. There goes the alarm. It must be time to get up. Oh no, Buster has gone back to sleep. Oh dear. And now he's going to be late for school. Quick, they've got to get everything ready. Huh? What does Buster need? Rucksack, check. Lunchbox, check. Pencil case and school book, check. But what is he missing? The ruler. Aha! There it is! It's time to head off for school. Wait a second. Buster forgot his shark tooth. <gasps> quick, Buster, quick! Shark tooth? Check. They're going to have to race to get there on time. Go, Buster! Looks like the teacher is getting worried. <laughs> All his friends are already at school and he's going to be late. Oh no! Phew! He did it! Just in time! What a crazy morning! Buster and Mommy are decorating the house for Halloween. But look, they still need a pumpkin. Looks like there are pumpkins for sale this way. Buster and Grandpa will go and fetch one. Whoa! So many pumpkins to choose from! Buster wants this big one. Now, Grandpa's going to carve a face into the pumpkin and turn it into a jack-o'-lantern. Eyes, a mouth, and a nose. Oh. But what's Buster seen? A sheet? Hmm. Oh, Buster pretended to be a ghost and scared Grandpa. But now the pumpkin is rolling away. Oh no, it's rolling towards the road. Phew, he just missed it. Quick, Buster and Grandpa are chasing after the runaway pumpkin. Buster's almost got it. Oops. There's Diggly building a wall. Oh dear, the pumpkin spooked him. Now it's rolling away again. No time to stop and play. They've got to keep chasing it. Poor Grandpa is out of breath. It's up to Buster to catch the pumpkin. Quick, it's heading for that pond. Buster's jumping for it. Well done, Buster. It rolled right into place outside the front door. Phew, that was lucky. <laughs> Mommy looks very pleased. Good job, Buster and Grandpa. <laughs> it's fall. And Buster the Bus and his friends are outside playing. <laughs> Look at all the leaves falling off the trees. <laughs> What's this? I think Scout has an idea for a game. <laughs> Oh, Scout wants to play hide and seek. What a great idea. You count, Buster, whilst everybody else goes and hides. Tony the truck is hiding in the barn. Jesse the Jeep is hiding under that box. 
Diggly the Digger is going to dig a hole behind those bushes. Quick, Scout. You need to find somewhere to hide before Buster is done counting. But where? Three, two, one. Coming, ready or not. Where is everyone? Buster's going to seek. Is anyone hiding in that barn? Yes! You found Tony the truck, Buster. What about these boxes? Is anyone hiding here? I guess not. Wait a minute. Is that box following you, Buster? That must mean... Yes, you found Jesse the Jeep. Good job. What about those bushes? Anyone hiding there? Look, there's Robin. <gasps> Did you see that? I wonder if... That's right! You found Diggly the Digger! Hooray! That just leaves Scout. I wonder where she could be hiding. Wait, did you notice something funny about that pile of leaves? There, Scout! Well done, Buster! <laughs> you found all of your friends' hiding places! Wasn't that Fun. Buster's birthday? <laughs> Mommy and Grandpa are setting up a very special party. <laughs> Don't eat the food yet, Buster! You've got to wait until your guests arrive. Oh, look! Here they are! It's Scout, Ash, and Bandit! Everyone's so excited for the party! What's Bandit up to? Hmm, that cake looks yummy! Not yet, Bandit! First, we're playing party games. They're playing musical statues. They have to dance until the music stops. Great move, Scout! And freeze! Oh no! Scout is losing balance! And so is Buster! They are out of the game. It's only Bandit and Ash left. And dance! Bandit is losing balance! Oh no! He knocked Ash over so he could win. And now Ash is out of the game. But Grandpa didn't see Bandit cheating. Hmm, that wasn't very nice, Bandit. Now they're playing Pass the Parcel. They pass the present, and when the music stops, they can take off the wrapping paper. Hooray for Ash! <gasps> Bandit has cheated again! He took the parcel after the music stopped. <laughs> Poor Ash! <laughs> Bandit isn't playing very fair. Buster is telling Bandit that he's making Ash feel upset. He needs to think about how his actions affect the feelings of others. It's time for some birthday cake! Blow out the candles! Go, Buster! What a feast! All the delicious food has been eaten. Well, almost. Don't worry, Ash. Have some birthday cake. Bandit feels really bad for making Ash sad. Bandit is really sorry and gives Ash his ball back. It's okay, Bandit. Ash forgives you. But remember, it's not all about the winning. It's about having fun together. Buster's kindness saved the party. Happy birthday, Buster. Hey there, Buster. Hey, little Robin. That's right, Buster. Look both ways before crossing the tracks. Whoa, that was a close one. Wasn't Suki the train looking where she was going? There's Otis the police car. Something must be wrong. Quick, Buster, maybe you can help. Oh no, Suki has fallen asleep on the job. If someone doesn't stop her, who knows where she'll end up? What are we going to do? Wait, I think Buster has an idea. A rope? Good thinking, Buster. 
You can use that to slow Suki down. Nice catch, Robin. That's it. Pull! You can do it. Oh no, the rope snapped. Suki is still out of control. I think she's going faster now. You've got to catch up with her, quick! What's Buster seeing now? Oh dear, it's Digger. Suki is heading right towards him and he hasn't even noticed. Another track, it goes up a hill too. Look out, Buster. Phew, that was close. Well ducked, Buster. You need to change the tracks, Buster, so Suki goes up the hill. Hurry, Buster. You can do it. Almost there. Yes, just in time. Well done, Buster. You changed the track. Suki is heading up a steep hill. That'll slow her down. There. At last, she stopped safely. I think Suki is waking up. Thank goodness nobody was hurt. Well done, Buster. You helped Otis and saved the day. <laughs> it's Halloween, and Buster is at Daddy's house. Oh, but Halloween can be scary. <laughs> Daddy Bus has an idea. He's going to tell a Halloween story. Daddy's going to tell a story of the brave wizard's adventure to find the magic gems and save Halloween. Buster the brave wizard went on an adventure. He had to find all the magic gems. There must be gems in that castle. They're guarded by a monster. <laughs> This wizard must be very brave, Dad. <sighs> the wizard was the bravest of all, Buster! <laughs> ah. The hero presses on through the dark woods towards the castle. <laughs> Something stirs in the darkness up ahead in the forest. What is it, Dad? A werewolf? A ghost? A were-ghost! The mysterious shadow grows larger. Is it the monster? He found a jewel. Well done. <laughs> Finally, the wizard reached the mysterious castle. There must be more gems inside, but how to get there? He needs to lower the drawbridge. But how? The wizard could use his magic. Ha! <laughs> Good idea. The brave adventurer pushed forward inside the castle walls. <laughs> Onward, into the castle. How brave the wizard is. What will our hero do? Run or continue? Continue, continue! Ooh. The wizard has to find the treasure and save Halloween! <laughs> but what's that behind them? It's the monster! If the wizard wants to get those magic jewels, he'll need to get past it. Wait, Daddy. The monster must be really lonely. Oh, I suppose so, yes. The monster is lonely. Maybe the wizard should help the monster. He needs a friend. And so the brave wizard rolled up and used his magic to make the castle all warm and bright. <laughs> the monster is you, Dad. <laughs> the monster was so grateful he gave the wizard all the magic jewels. So brave Buster <laughs> saved Halloween for everyone. Buster, it's time to get ready for school. I want to go back to school. <sighs> What's wrong, Buster? I made your favourite breakfast for your first day back. I'm just not that hungry, Mum. It's not like you, Buster. Are you nervous about going back to school? No, I'm not. Well, I mean a little, maybe. You'll enjoy it when you get there, and you'll get to see all your friends. I guess so. 
Here's your lunch. Hmm. I can't wait to see everyone and to get to class. I wonder what we'll learn today. I'm excited. I'm hungry. Hey, Scout. Hey, Buster. Hey, Diggly. Buster, are you coming? Uh, I'll, I'll catch you guys up. But Buster, I've calculated at current speed, so long as there's no traffic, we only have one minute to spare to get to class on time. And I'm the fastest. I can catch you guys up. Don't worry. Slow coach. I'm not a coach. I'm a digger. Welcome back to school, kids. Did you all have a good holiday? <laughs> <laughs> so, today we are going to learn about road safety. Who knows what the colours of the traffic lights mean? Me, me, me! Let's start with the red one. Me, me, me! I do! Uh, Bandit, do you know? Me, me, me! Diggly? Stop! Correct! Well done! The orange one. Uh, Scout. Wait! Ugh. Well done! And finally... Buster, the green one. Go! Go, Buster! <laughs> yes, well done. So... Who wants to practice driving towards the traffic light as I point at each one? Red for stop, orange for slow and wait, and green for go. Go, Buster! <laughs> OK, Buster, are you ready? What's this? You should have been concentrating, Buster, rather than showing off to your friends. I'm sorry. Scout. Diggly. Well done, Bandit. <laughs> oh, you can share mine. Are you sure? Of course. <laughs> hey, give it back. I'll get your lunch back, Scout. <gasps> Diggly, the lights! <gasps> <gasps> Phew. Thanks, Buster. You saved me. You just have to concentrate, Diggly. <laughs> like teacher says. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have taken your things. I just wanted to play with you guys. Thanks for saying sorry. You can play with us, Bandit. You just need to ask. Really? Of course. Because I'm still the fastest. <laughs> <laughs> mum, mum, mum! <laughs> Did you have a good day? Were you nervous at school? Nah, but I ate my lunch on the way to school and I was trying to show off and fail the lesson. But then, when Bandit took Scout's lunch, I raced after Diggly and stopped him right before he went through the red light and crashed into the barrier. Well done. I'm proud of you, Buster. Can I go out and play? Of course you can. Come on, Bandit. Join in and be on my side. Brand new snowy day. And Buster can't wait to go outside and play. It's so much fun to play in the snow. And the best game of all is a snowball fight. Diggly and Scout are on one team, but Buster needs a teammate. Look, there's Bandit. He can be on Buster's team, though Buster and Bandit don't always get along. Time to start throwing snowballs. 
<laughs> Buster and Bandit are hiding behind that hill. Hmm. Buster thinks they should go this way. But Bandit thinks they should go that way. Oh, dear. They can't agree. They're not working together as a team. Buster is sneaking through the trees. But Scout has spotted him. Look out! Oh, dear. Bandit is trying to sneak behind the fence. Buster and Bandit aren't doing very well. But look! Scout and Diggly are working together. That's it! If Buster and Bandit want to win, they'll need to work together like a team. Whoosh! Off they go! And that's more like it! Now it's a real fun snowball fight! It's much better with teamwork! Who threw that snowball? Grandpa! The more players, the more fun it is! Hello, Buster! Whoa! Look at all that spooky slime! You're splashing it everywhere. Look, it's Terry the tractor. I don't think he wants to get covered in slime. Look how careful he's being. Zoom! <laughs> Wait, look out, Buster. You're heading straight for Terry. Whew, that was a close one. Watch out, Buster. <laughs> oh, dear. You splashed Terry with slime. I don't think he's very impressed. Off Buster goes again, having fun in the green slime. Watch out! Oh no! Buster is stuck in the sticky slime. Dear, oh dear. He really is stuck tight. The sun's going down and it's getting dark. Spooky! I hope Buster's going to be okay. Look everyone, it's Terry Tractor. He's come to save the day. Terry doesn't look too happy about it though. Please help Buster, Terry. He just needs one big push. Ah. Can he do it? One, two, here we go! Ah. Hooray! Thanks, Terry. <laughs> oh, Buster. Thank goodness Terry Tractor was there to save Buster from the sticky green slime. <laughs> Bye, Terry. Bye, Buster. It's a bright new morning, and Buster looks so excited. It's Diggly's birthday today. Buster can't wait to go to the party. Buster eats breakfast as quick as he can. Look, it's Scout. She's got Diggly's present ready and wrapped up. How exciting. Oh no! Buster accidentally ran over the present! It's flat as a pancake! Poor Buster! It was just an accident! But wait! I think Buster has an idea! Look! Scout's grabbing that old cardboard box! Oh! And Buster's grabbing that bowl of sweets! There's the wooden stick, too. <laughs> and the arts and crafts box. I wonder what they're up to. It's another present. <laughs> but what could be inside? Now Buster and Scout are speeding off to Diggly's party. They mustn't be late. Diggly is waiting. His party has already started. But phew, there's Scout and Buster. They made it. <laughs> Diggly's opening his present, and... Whoa! It's a pinata! It's Diggly's birthday, so he gets to hit it with the stick. Off he goes! One more smack! Look at all those sweets! An amazing birthday present! Buster, our favorite yellow bus. But wait!
You don't look as bright and yellow as usual. Oh, Buster, I think you need a new coat of paint. You're looking a little scruffy. Great idea! A trip to the paint shop will do the trick. He looks like one happy customer. Buster can't wait to get a fresh new coat of yellow paint. He's going to look good as new. Oh my, what was that? That made you jump, didn't it, Buster? Oh no! Buster's mixed up the paint cans. I don't think he's realized. Is that gonna be the right color? Here goes, Buster. A fresh new coat of yellow. Oh no! That's not yellow. Buster has been sprayed red. And I don't think he's noticed. Take a look at yourself, Buster. You're a red bus. Quickly, back to the paint shop. Oh dear, you've knocked over all the paint. How will you be able to tell which color is which? Here goes. Oh no, that's not quite right. Buster is now blue. Jesse seems very surprised. Yes, it's because of how blue you are, Buster. Maybe this time you'll come out yellow. Hmm, still not yellow. Now Buster is green. Look at how confused Tony is. Fourth time lucky. Close your eyes and wish for yellow, Buster. Oh no! Jesse and Scout still don't seem to recognize you, Buster. Buster has now been sprayed pink. Wait, Buster, I'm not sure that's the answer. <laughs> Buster the rainbow colored bus. I'm not sure if Robin approves. Which paint can to choose from? One of these must be yellow. The moment of truth. Phew! There we go! That's the Buster the Bus we all know. With a bright new shiny coat of yellow paint. That was quite a colorful adventure. Buster is heading off to school. Wait a second, Buster. Don't forget, it's school photo day today. So you need an extra polish. <laughs> Bye, Mommy Bus. <laughs> Look! Terry Tractor is here to take the school photos. Bandit and Ash are up first. Smile! Buster's turn next. And he wants to get an action shot. Whoops! Buster slipped! Watch out, Scout! Oh no, what's wrong? The teacher is handing Buster a mirror. <gasps> Buster has knocked out his wobbly front tooth! Oh no! And now Buster is too embarrassed to have his photo taken. It's okay, Buster. You can have it taken another day. Buster is feeling really sad about missing out on the photos. But Mommy Bus is here to pick him up. And she's taking him to the dentist to get his tooth looked at. Hooray! <laughs> Buster is a little bit nervous. Don't worry, Buster. Amber the ambulance is here to take a look at that tooth for you. It's time to sit in the special dentist chair. Wow, that looks like so much fun! And now it's time to check that tooth. Don't worry, Buster. There's nothing to be scared of. First, Amber is looking at the tooth with a little mirror. Open wide, Buster. Say, ah. Uh. And what's that? Amber's going to play Buster a video. It's another bus, just like Buster. <laughs> and his tooth has fallen out. But don't worry, another one will grow in its place. He might be missing a tooth for now, but soon he'll have a brand new one. So there's nothing to be embarrassed about. <laughs> Buster now feels much better. Thanks, Amber. <laughs> And now he's going back to school to get his photo taken. <laughs> Gather in, Buster. Say cheese. Hey, Buster. Oh, no. 
Oh, Buster looks really ill. <laughs> Hello, Scout. I think Scout wants to play. I don't think Buster is well enough to play today. Buster is feeling really ill. Quick, Scout, go and get some help. Oh, poor Buster. It'll be okay. We all get poorly now and then. Oh, look! Scout has brought Amber the ambulance to have a look at Buster. Great idea, Scout. Amber will know what to do to make Buster feel better. It looks like Amber the ambulance is helping Buster back into his garage. Let's see if she can find what's wrong with Buster. Firstly, let's check Buster's tires. Oh, look! This one has lost all of its air. It needs pumping up. There we go. That's better. Buster looks better already. Oh, but you're still a bit under the weather. Ah, yes. Let's check Buster's temperature with a thermometer. It doesn't look good, Buster. It's time for Amber to check Buster's engine. Oh, no! Buster's leaking oil! No wonder he's not feeling well. Amber will fix this with her spanner. It's okay, Buster. It'll be done soon. Just a few more turns. There we go. Great job, Amber. Buster looks like he's back to his normal self again. I think you're well enough to go out and play, Buster. <laughs> he seems very pleased. That's the Buster we know and love. It's time for Amber to head off. Bye, Amber. Thank you for looking after Buster. <laughs> Off Scout and Buster go to play. Buster the bus and Scout the car are playing soccer. Buster shoots. Goal! Well done, Buster. Great work. Whoa, it's a soccer bus. He plays for the big bus soccer team. He wants Buster to come try out for the team. But oh no, Buster is too shy. Scout encourages him, and Buster says okay. He'll come to the big game tomorrow. Scout is very proud of her friend, but Buster is still nervous. That night, Buster is sleeping peacefully in his garage. Buster dreams he's playing on the big bus soccer team. The game starts, but oh dear, the buses play rough. Now it's Buster's turn in goal. He tries to save it, but oh dear, the soccer buses don't look very impressed. Poor Buster, he's tried so hard. Phew, it was just a bad dream. But now Buster's even more nervous about trying out for the team. Scout does her best to encourage him. Buster can do it. She believes in him. Now it's time for the big game. Robin blows his whistle and the game begins. Oh no, the red bus has been injured. They can't play anymore. Buster will have to step in. Go on, Buster, you can do it. Buster kicks the ball and the game goes on. Buster is going in goal now. The blue bus takes a shot and... Buster saved it! Well done, Buster! You did so well! Hooray! That was so much fun! Buster the bus and Scout the car are playing soccer. Buster shoots. Goal! Well done, Buster! Great work! Whoa! It's a soccer bus! He plays for the big bus soccer team. He wants Buster to come try out for the team. But oh no, Buster is too shy. Scout encourages him, and Buster says okay. He'll come to the big game tomorrow. Scout is very proud of her friend, but Buster is still nervous. That night, Buster is sleeping peacefully in his garage. Buster dreams he's playing on the big bus soccer team. The game starts, but oh dear, the buses play rough. Now it's Buster's turn in goal. He tries to save it, but oh dear, the soccer buses don't look very impressed. Poor Buster, he's tried so hard. Phew, it was just a bad dream. 
But now Buster's even more nervous about trying out for the team. Oh. <laughs> Scout does her best to encourage him. Buster can do it. She believes in him. <laughs> now it's time for the big game. Robin blows his whistle and the game begins. Oh no! The red bus has been injured. They can't play anymore. Buster will have to step in. Go on, Buster, you can do it! Buster kicks the ball and the game goes on. Buster is going in goal now. The blue bus takes a shot and... Buster saved it! Well done, Buster! You did so well! Hooray! That was so much fun! It's Jessie the Jeep. She's got a cake. Wow, that looks tasty. But here comes Bandit Bus. He looks mischievous. Oh no! He's eating Jessie's cake. That's not fair at all. Poor Jessie. There's Buster the Bus. And there's Bandit, driving too fast. <sighs> Look, Buster's gone to play with Scout. He's given her a soccer ball as a present. Look at Scout go! Oh, look at that! Diggly is building a colorful tower. But here comes Bandit. I wonder what that awful bully is up to. Oh no! He's knocked over Diggly's tower. Bandit is a menace. Uh-oh, he's seen Scout's ball. Bandit is stealing the ball for himself. What a bully. Buster wants to do something. Poor Scout is really upset. Buster wants to help his friend. He's going to stand up to Bandit and get him to give the ball back. I don't think Bandit will listen to Buster. He's going to bully him instead. It's not fair. But wait, Jesse is standing beside Buster. Scout is here to help too. They're all fed up with Bandit being a bully. There's Otis, the police car, enjoying an ice cream. Oops, Bandit has backed into Otis. Otis looks mad. Serves Bandit right, being mean to everyone. Now Buster, Scout, and Jesse can play soccer in peace. Buster, Bandit, and Scout are having a sleepover. But they're still wide awake. They're having a great time staying up. They're too excited to go to sleep. <gasps> Who's that? It's Grandpa Bus. He says it's getting late. It's time to go to bed. They can't play games and be up all night. Hmm, maybe this night light will help them get to sleep. Wow, look at those stars. Buster loves stars. He wonders what it would be like to be a space rocket flying fast through them. Oh look, it's space rocket Buster. Buster and his friends are using their imagination. They're flying through space. Check it out, there's Earth. They're going to race to it, ready? Steady, go! Buster is in the lead. Oh no, Bandit knocked him off course. Aw, oh, now Buster's far behind. How can he zoom back ahead? Aha! Whoa, Buster is spinning around Saturn. Now he's going really fast. What a clever idea. He's overtaking Bandit and Scout. Hmm, what's Bandit up to now? 
<laughs> Careful! Meteors! Bandit is throwing them at Buster and Scout! Hmm, they have to stop him! They're throwing an even bigger meteor back at Bandit! That'll teach him! And the race is back on! Buster and Scout are neck and neck! Nearly there! Space Rocket Buster wins the race! Way to go! Uh-oh! Busted! Again! Grandpa heard them playing! That was a lot of fun! But now it really is time to go to bed! Good night, everyone! To see the shooting stars, by my calculations, the best place to see them will be up the top of the mountain. Loading map! It's go time! This way! Follow me! Uh, shouldn't we stick to the road? We'll get to the shooting stars in time. Promise! I have a bad feeling about this. Shortcut was a bad idea. Why can you just go the way I wanted for once? Now we're gonna miss the shooting stars. Uh, uh, we will see the shooting stars. We can get out of this. How? Uh, I've got a brilliant idea. Oh, forget it, no one can hear us. According to my calculations, we'll miss the shooting stars for sure. <laughs> oh, wait! That's it! Diggly, what happens when you add water to mud? I don't know. It goes gloopy, I guess. That's right! And if you make it gloopy enough... <laughs> we'll slide out! Go back with bunch! Let's move! Ash! Splash! It's working! <laughs> Look out! The cliff edge! Ah! It's not a cliff edge, it's a stunt jump! Follow me! Buster, are you sure about this? Trust me, Diggly. I won't let you down this time. That was some shortcut. Whoa. Look! Ooh. <gasps> this is a great viewing spot. We made it after all. Sorry, Diggly. I should have listened to you. Next time, maybe we'll just stick to the road. <laughs> <laughs> Look at those paint brushes. Buster and his friends are painting the walls in Buster's room today. How exciting! Mommy Bus is bringing them lots of different colored paints. They can paint the wall underneath the window. Hmm, what color should Buster choose? Scout has chosen purple. And Ash has picked red. And Buster, yellow, of course. Let's paint! Oops! Ash adds a red splat to match Scouts. And Buster adds a yellow splat. Awesome! I wonder what Scout is painting first. It's a rocket! Awesome! Cool! Buster's go next. What's he going to paint? 
a bumblebee! Not on the cabinet, Ash! Now they're having a paint fight! Be careful! That paint is very messy! Oh dear! They're getting paint everywhere! What a mess! Uh-oh! The yellow paint is all over the floor! <gasps> and now the purple! Yikes! Mommy Bus is wondering what all that noise is! That was so much fun! Uh-oh! They didn't realize they were making such a mess! But Buster has a plan! They can use Ash's hose to clear it up! The water is washing away the paint! Great job, Ash! Oh no! Mommy Bus is coming and they haven't finished clearing up the mess yet! Time to get all cleaned up! Ash is hosing Buster down! Splash! Now it's Scout's turn! And that looks like so much fun! And finally, Ash! Well done, everyone! Wow! The room looks completely clean! Time for Ash and Scout to head off home! Oops! Well, not completely clean. Buster the Bus has come out to play! Watch out for that red paint, Buster! Oh, Buster's driven right through it! Look, Buster! You've painted some red lines with your tires! <laughs> I think Buster's had an idea. Nice work! You've painted a circle. A circle is round. Huh? It's the same shape as your wheel, Buster. Now you've colored the circle in, Buster. It's a red circle. Oh, hey, Scout. Come and join the fun. We're learning shapes. What shape is Scout painting? It's a square. A blue square. A square has four equal sides. <laughs> Hey there, Digger! Digger has come to paint shapes with Buster and Scout. <laughs> what shape will Digger paint? Digger isn't quite as fast as Buster and Scout. It's okay, Digger will be finished soon. It's a triangle! A triangle has three sides. <laughs> a yellow triangle. <laughs> Digger took so long to paint a shape that Buster and Scout have fallen asleep. Wake up, you two! What other shapes can we draw? A green rectangle. Great work, Buster. A gold star. That looks fantastic, Scout. And a lovely pink heart. Digger is painting a diamond. Wow, look at all the colors go! It's a wonderful rainbow diamond! So many different colored shapes! Learning the shapes was so much fun! We made a square, circle, triangle, star, heart, rectangle, and a diamond! Well done, everyone! Look! There's Scout! And there's Buster! I think they're playing tag! What's Buster seen? Oh, wow! A maze! Scout is going inside! Go on, Buster! Try and find her! I wonder which way Scout went! There she is! Off they go, winding their way through the maze! Which way should Buster go now? This way. Oh look, a yellow flower. How nice. A few more turns and which way this time? This way. 
Wait a minute, it's that flower again. Buster's gone round in circles. Maybe if he backs up, he can find his way out? There's Scout. She looks lost, too. Whoa, Buster and Scout have found each other. Thank goodness. But now, they need to find the way out. Scout is balancing on Buster's roof. Maybe she can see a way out. There it is. Good job, Scout. <laughs> They're speeding off towards the exit. But which way is it? Oh dear, they're still lost in the maze. Look, tire tracks. They can follow those all the way to the way out. Good thinking, Buster. There's that flower again. A little further and hooray! They made it out. Great teamwork, guys. <laughs> Look, it's Rita the sports car. She's speeding into the maze. Oh well, I guess Buster and Scout will have to help her find her way out. Look, it's Buster the bus. But whoa, he sure looks sleepy. He's driving off the road. Oh no, Buster's ended up in the muddy puddle. And now he's stuck. Poor Buster. How will he get out? The next morning, Scout visits Buster's garage. But, oh dear, Buster is nowhere to be found. Where is he? But look, muddy tracks. Scout is following them to see where Buster is. There's Diggly the Digger. Scout tells him Buster's missing. They need to find him. Scout and Diggly search together. Look, a trail of sweets. Where could it lead? Whoa, what was that? Aw, phew, it's just Robin. Scout explains that Buster is missing, and Robin agrees to help search too. They'll have a better chance of finding him if they work together. Poor Buster is lonely and cold. Scout looks behind the trees. Oh. Diggly looks beside the rocks. What's Robin seen? Some more tire tracks. Look, there's Buster. He's stuck in the mud. He's been here so long. Robin goes to tell Diggly and Scout that he's found oh. Buster. He's just over the hill. There's poor Buster. <laughs> Diggly and Scout can help. Working together, Diggly and Scout pull Buster out of the muddy puddle. Huh? Now Buster is free at last. He's very grateful to his friends for rescuing him. Now he's back, Whoa. safe and sound in his garage. Hey there, Buster. Whoa, look at all the spooky Halloween decorations. Spiders, jack-o'-lanterns, creepy. Uh-oh, what's that? It's so big and dark. Oh, I think Buster is really scared. Don't be frightened, Buster. It's just your shadow. See? It's just the lighting shining past you. Pretty cool, isn't it? Hmm, I think this is the right way to go home. Let's go, Buster. Oh no, the lightning struck the street lamp. Now all the lights are going out. Poor Buster. I think he's scared of the dark. But wait, what's that? The full moon's come out. That'll light up the whole town like a big lantern. Come on, Buster, off we go. Oh dear me, clouds are moving over the moon again. And now there's a lightning storm coming. Oh no, Buster is scared of the storm too. Come on, Buster, you can be brave. It's just thunder and lightning. That's right, it's not scary, it's spectacular. Nice one, Buster. You were brave and faced your fears. Look, it's Tony the truck. He looks even more frightened by the storm than Buster. Good job, Buster. Go and help Tony. Make him feel safe.
There's no need to be afraid. See? The storm is over and the moon is back. And that's just your shadow. Happy Halloween, Buster and Tony. Buster and Scout are on their way home from school. Bye, Scout. What's Buster spotted? Oh, look! It's Diggly and Daisy. Buster wants to help. But safety first. Look at that awesome builder's hat. Buster is helping them move a crate off Rocky the Riverboat. Great teamwork, guys. Now they're placing the crate on the construction site. Mr. Rubble is off to get some lunch. See you later, Mr. Rubble. Oh, no! The crate is sinking into the mud. Go, Buster, go! Oh, no. Now Buster is stuck in the mud as well. Daisy to the rescue. <laughs> nope, that didn't work. What's that? Diggly is hooked up to that crane. And he's pulling Buster out. It's working. Just a little bit more. Oops. Now they're all stuck. And Mr. Rubble hasn't noticed. But Buster's got a plan. He's wrapping the wire around the crane and attaching it to the crate so they can pull themselves out. Brilliant idea, Buster! Jiggly and Daisy are both pulling the rope at different times. But they need to work together. And that's it! Hooray! It worked! Mr. Rubble still hasn't noticed them. So they quickly pull the crate out. Everything is back to normal. Well, not quite back to normal. They're all covered in mud. It's time to get cleaned up. Mr. Rubble is spraying them with the hose. There, that's much better. Now it's time for a spot of lunch. Yum, yum. But what's that? Mr. Rubble has driven straight into the mud. Don't worry, Mr. Rubble. They know just what to do. Oh, wow, a soccer ball. Look, it's Scout. She wants to play. Great kick, Buster. Nice one, Scout. Who's that driving down the road? It's Tony the truck. Oh, no, Buster. Be careful where you kick the ball. Watch out for Tony. Ouch, that must have hurt. I hope Tony is okay. Buster, you have to be more careful. Watch out for that pin. Oh, no. It's punctured Buster's tire. Look, Scout. Tony the truck needs help. I know who we need. Oh. Yay, Amber the ambulance. Good job, Scout. It sure is an eventful day. I hope you feel better soon, Tony. Oh, Buster, that sure looks painful. Don't worry now, it was only an accident. Tony is in safe hands and Amber will come back shortly. Buster, look, it's Amber. Let's get you fixed. Off to the garage, Buster goes. Uh -huh. Oh, wow, Tony looks Ooh. great. <laughs> Buster is getting a new tire. Ooh. All fixed. Mm. Uh -huh. Oh, Buster, wow. accidents happen. <laughs> Be more careful next time. <laughs> Great kick, Buster. <laughs> oh no, not again. 
Buster is being more careful. Look left. Look right. Now that's more like it. Well done, Buster. Over here, Buster. Oh no! Bandit Bus is stealing from the candy shop. Stop, thief! It's Otis the police car. He's come to investigate the case of the stolen candy. Bandit Bus went that way, Otis. I don't think Otis saw Bandit Bus get away. Great idea, Otis. Follow the trail of candy. I think we know who it will lead to. There he is. Stop, thief. Look, Otis. Some more clues. Keep following the trail. Wow, Bandit Bus is dropping a lot of candy. Oh, hey, Buster. Oh, I don't think that candy is for you. Buster loves candy. Oh, dear, the trail of candy has led straight to Buster the Bus. Otis must think that Buster is the thief. You've made a mistake, Otis. Buster is innocent. Poor Buster, what are you going to do? Otis is putting Buster in jail. Oh, Buster. Oh, here comes Scout. Maybe Scout can help Buster get out of jail. You have to help Buster, Scout. Prove he's innocent. That's right, Scout. Follow the trail of candy to find the truth. Scout the detective is on the case. There he is. Bandit Bus caught red-handed stealing from the toy shop. You're going down this time, Bandit Bus. Stop right there. In the name of the law, you're under arrest. It's time to put things right and get Buster out of jail. Come on out, Buster. You're innocent. And in goes Bandit the Bus. Thanks, Scout. You're a great detective. If it wasn't for you, Buster would still be locked up. I'm sorry, Bandit Bus, but you had it coming. Stealing is against the law. Well done, Otis. Bye, Bandit. Buster looks so excited. I wonder why. A storybook. Buster wants Mommy to read to him. Buster loves a good fairy tale. Mommy's reading Buster the story of Goldilocks and the Three Bears. When the bears had gone out, Goldilocks came to the window. She tried their porridge, but the first bowl was too hot. Buster thinks that's very funny. But look at the time. Mommy can't read all day. Buster's upset. He wants to know what happens next in the story. But Mommy knows what to do. Maybe Grandpa can read to Buster? Grandpa is out watering the plants, but Buster wants him to read more of the storybook. Yes, Grandpa can read to him for a bit. He loves stories of great adventures and brave heroes. What's happening now? Goldilocks sits on a chair that's too small, and it breaks. How funny. Buster loves this story. But what's this? Mommy says it's time for dinner. The rest of the story will have to wait. Buster has some nice fish fingers and vegetables for dinner, but he's eating them all really fast. He wants to get back to the story as soon as possible. Hmm, Mommy and Grandpa are still eating. They can't read to him right now. Buster really wants to know what happens next. Look, he's trying to read it himself. He's not very good at reading, but he's trying really hard. Wow, he's getting it. Mommy and Grandpa are so proud of him. Good job, Buster. But, oh dear, he's getting sleepy too. Mommy's reading the book to Buster as a bedtime story. Now Goldilocks is asleep in the bear's bed. Oh, look, Buster has fallen asleep. Aw, he'd had such a busy day, he couldn't stay awake for the end. Good night, Buster. I wonder what Buster has seen. A soft play park? Oh, wow. Look, there's Scout and Digger making a bridge. Perfect for Scout to go under. What's that over there? I think it's a ball pit? Yes, it is! Go on, Buster. You know you want to. Woo! Good jump, Buster. Oh, look, it's Billy the Bulldozer. He's jumping on the trampoline. He looks like he's having lots of fun. Wow, Digger, you're really good on the monkey bars. Keep going. I wonder why Billy is pushing all those soft play shapes. Oh, it's for Digger to land on. Great landing, Digger. Ooh, Scout, be careful. 
That looks difficult to balance. <laughs> oh, wow, Scout, you're a pro. <laughs> Ready, oh. steady, go! <laughs> Who's going to win? Huh? It's very close. Scout finishes first. Huh? Well done, Scout. <laughs> Maybe next time, Buster. <laughs> that looked really fun. I think Digger wants to play hide and seek. Good idea. Okay, Buster. You start counting while the others hide. <laughs> oh, good idea, Scout and Billy. That's a great hiding place. Digger's going to hide in the ball pit and Billy at the top of the slide. Coming, ready or not. Can you find your friends, Buster? Where could they be? Hmm, not there. Don't worry, Buster, you'll find them. You've just got to keep looking. There's Billy. Great spot, Buster. <laughs> Only two left. That looks funny. Oh, there's Scout. Well done. One to go. Let's check the ball pit. Oh, Digger. Great hiding spot. What a great game. Buster is having fun splashing in some very muddy puddles outside his house. Look, it's Grandpa Bus. Oops, now they're both covered in mud. But Grandpa has a plan. Where's he taking Buster? They're at the car wash to get cleaned up. Hooray! It looks like the car wash is all out of bubbles. Aha! There's the soap. Grandpa adds a small squirt. And Buster turns on the car wash. Go, Buster, go! Hang on. That's a lot of soap, Grandpa Bus. <laughs> Buster is covered in soapy bubbles. How funny. That was a very good joke, Grandpa. Now it's Grandpa's turn to get cleaned up. Looks like Buster's got a plan. He's getting his own back. Grandpa is covered in soap. He looks very silly. Look, Terry the tractor is here for a wash. Whoa, go easy, Buster. The bubbles are overflowing. Oh dear, what a soapy mess. Otis doesn't look very happy. Time to clear up the mess. What a silly day. It's a bright, sunny day. Buster and Cozy Coop are visiting the beach. They're playing volleyball. And look, Sham the shark wants to play too. Cozy throws the ball to Sham. Oh dear, the ball has popped on Sham's teeth. Whoops, but what's this? Is that a treasure map? Whoa, there's buried Whoa. treasure. <laughs> and it's buried on that desert island. But how will they get across the water? I think Buster has an idea. Whoa, Buster has built a ramp out of sand. Whoosh. Oh no. Splash. Buster couldn't jump far enough. I guess they'll have to try something else. What's Cozy seen? A giant lily pad. Maybe they can drift across the water. Uh-oh, Cozy's come to a stop. Cozy tries paddling, but they just go around in circles. Luckily, Sham can push them back to shore. Thanks, Sham. But they're still no closer to the island. But what's this? Sham has a raft. Now they can cross the water in no time. They've reached the island. Now, time to find that treasure. X marks the spot. Is this X the buried treasure? No, that's just some twigs. Is this X the treasure? No, that's just some seaweed. What about this X? There's the treasure chest. Well done, Cozy. 
Look at all that shiny treasure. And look, a golden ball. Now they can play catch again. Well done, everyone. Hey there, Buster. He's going for a drive with Scout. Look, there's Tony the delivery truck. Looks like Scout and Buster are going to follow Tony to see where he's going today. They're having so much fun together. <laughs> Silly Scout. Buster isn't paying attention to the road. Watch out, Buster. Whew, that was a close one. Pay attention, Buster. You nearly crashed into the back of Tony. Oh, look. There's a pothole in the road, and Tony is heading straight for it. Oh, no. The pothole has caused Tony's doors to unlock. Watch out, Buster and Scout. It looks like some of those boxes might tumble out. The boxes have started to fly out into the road. I don't think Tony has even noticed. And another box is about to fall out. Wow, quick thinking, Buster. Great catch. Here comes another one. Well done, Scout. Great work. Oh, no. Be careful, Scout. Scout has lost control and skidded off the road. Her box has gone flying up into that tree. Oh, look. Tony is going to have to stop at that red light. This will buy you some time. Quickly, Buster. You haven't got long to return the boxes. <laughs> nice thinking, Buster. Now all you need to do is work out how to load the boxes back where they belong. It looks like Scout has an idea. Great work, Scout. You can use that plank of wood as a ramp. There we go. A perfect place to unload the boxes. Great teamwork. <laughs> now you can close the doors, Buster. Just in time for the green light. Off Tony goes. I guess he'll never know how close he came to losing all of his boxes. Well done, Buster. Well done, Scout. Wow, Buster, look at that red balloon. Why don't you try and catch it? <laughs> nice try, Buster. But it's floating away. Aw, Buster looks sad. Oh, hey, little Robin. You might be able to catch the runaway red balloon. There we go. Thanks, Robin. That's a nice looking balloon, Buster. Oh, wow, there's another balloon. This one is green. Quick, Robin, catch it. There we go. Now you have two balloons, Buster. Gosh, look at all those colorful balloons. You know what to do, Robin. <laughs> Buster! The balloons are lifting you off the ground. Robin has lost Buster. He's up there, Robin. Buster's flying. It's okay, Buster. Don't be scared. Look at the view from up here. <laughs> Terry can't work out where that horn is coming from. Look up there, Terry. Is it a bird? Is it a plane? No, it's Buster the Bus. <laughs> There's something you don't see every day. Oh, Buster, you're floating quite high now. Terry looks so small down there on the ground. I think Buster is starting to get scared. You don't want to end up in space, Buster. Robin, you've got to help. Great idea. If you pop the balloons, huh? Buster will hopefully float down. Oh, no. Oh. Buster's falling really quickly. It's okay, Buster. You've nearly reached the ground. I think a few more balloons will do it, Robin. And touchdown. Buster is pleased to be back on the ground. I think we should leave the flying to Robin, Buster. Oh, where's Robin going? Ha, <laughs> huh, another balloon? I think Buster has had enough of balloons for one day. Bye, Buster. <laughs> Bye, Robin. It's a sunny day at Buster's house. And Buster and Grandpa are having a great time playing together. <laughs> Mommy Bus is off to work. Will Buster and Grandpa be able to make dinner together? Whoa, some real cooking. Buster is very excited. Let's cook. Grandpa sets up the stove. Hmm, but what comes next? Buster has an idea. It's chocolate sauce. Hmm, Grandpa doesn't think that's quite right for dinner. Let's take a look at the recipe. They've gathered all the ingredients together. Buster starts by adding some flour to the bowl. Whoa, easy there, Buster. Oops, 
The flower has gone everywhere. Now Grandpa and Buster are covered in flour. Buster is adding the finishing touches to the mixture. Careful the mixture doesn't go everywhere. Great job, Buster. Oops! Grandpa's tomato sauce has splattered all over the floor. And what's going on at the stove? The pot is bubbling over. Oh, look! It steamed up his glasses and now he can't see where he's going. Watch out, Grandpa! Oh, dear! This isn't going very well. Grandpa and Buster are clearing up the mess. But Mommy Bus is coming home from work. Uh-oh, they still haven't made dinner. What are they going to do? Grandpa gets some fish fingers out of the freezer. Aha, this gives Buster an idea. Time for chocolate sauce. Mommy Bus is wondering what Buster and Grandpa have made for dinner, just as they're finishing up. I wonder what they've cooked. It's fish fingers and green beans. And chocolate sauce. Are you sure about this, Buster? He gives it a try. Hmm, delicious! Mommy also gives it a try. And it's surprisingly tasty. Well done, hey everyone. What a lovely sunset. I bet Buster has had so much fun in the sun. I wonder what that green slime is. Oh no, it's dropped on Buster. And I don't think he's noticed. What's happening? Something isn't right. Look at all the gravestones and pumpkins appearing. This is spooky. And what's happened to Buster? I think that green slime has changed Buster into a zombie. That's one big pumpkin digger is carving, and it looks great. Who's that? Oh no, it's Zombie Buster. Digger is really frightened. But I don't think Buster knows what he looks like. Oh look, it's Scout. Buster is so happy to see her. Oh no, she seems scared too. Oh no, Scout is hiding from Buster, just like Digger did. Poor Buster is so upset and lonely. Come on, Scout. Buster is your friend. I think Scout has an idea. She wants Buster to follow her. Do you see now, Buster? You look like a zombie. That's why everyone is scared of you. Don't worry, Buster. Look, the slime has come off on Scout's wheel. I think Scout has a plan. A car wash? Good idea, Scout. Buster always loves a car wash. Yay, the green has gone. Buster is no longer a zombie. That was super spooky, Buster. Oh my, Scout. You sound like a werewolf. <laughs> Happy Halloween, everyone. <laughs> it's a cold winter's night. What's Buster up to? Oh, wow! A drawing of some fireworks! Buster's so excited because tonight he's going to a real fireworks display. But wait, he's forgotten something! A nice warm hat! There! Now it's time to go and watch the fireworks! <laughs> Oh, what's that? Fireworks make loud noises. Oh dear, they frightened Buster. He doesn't like loud noises. Aw, poor Buster. He's shaking. What's Mommy doing? Oh, Buster's toy car makes loud noises. But that's not scary. What's that loud noise? It's Grandpa with a soccer whistle. Buster loves soccer. He doesn't mind that loud noise either. What's that loud noise? Oh, it's popcorn popping. Buster loves popcorn. He doesn't mind that noise. Wow, the fireworks are so pretty. 
<sighs> Maybe loud noises aren't so bad after all. <laughs> Buster's going to give it another try. <laughs> Whoa! Look at those colorful fireworks! Boats! How exciting! <laughs> Buster's off! Oh no! The boat wasn't tied to the dock! The river is carrying Buster away! Daddy Bus to the rescue! Uh-oh! That boat has a leak! Oh! There's a bridge! Buster's grabbing on! Phew! Oh no! The pole broke off! Look out! Uh-oh! Buster has spotted rocks ahead! Good thinking, Buster! Oh no! The pole snapped! And look! A waterfall ahead! What's Daddy pointing to? A rope! Perfect! The waterfall isn't far away now! You can do it! Go, Buster! Nice throw! Daddy Bus is pulling Buster back to the shore. Nearly there. Just a bit further. Phew! Back on dry land. Now Buster and Daddy are fishing instead. That's much more relaxing. Hey there, Buster. Oh, wow, look at that! You're in the Wild West! <laughs> and check out your cowboy hat! That must be the sheriff with his shiny gold star! Oh, look! A lasso! Great work, Buster! Now you're a proper cowboy! There's Terry! Tip your hat, cowboy, and say hello! I don't think Terry looks too impressed! Wait! <gasps> it's Bandit Bus! And what's that on his back? A sack? I think he's robbed the sweet shop. What a villain he is. You must stop him, Buster. <laughs> Quick, Buster. He's getting away. Chase after him. Wake up, Sheriff. There's a robber on the loose. They're speeding alongside the train tracks. Faster, Buster. You can't let Bandit escape. Wow, Bandit jumped in front of Suki the train. Wait for the train to pass and... Where did he go? Oh no, he's going the other way. That was sneaky. After him, Buster. Bandit is trying to lose Buster in the cactus field. Careful, Buster. Those are really spiky. You've almost caught him. Look out! Are you okay, Buster? Oh no, the cactus has punctured your tire. Oh no, you'll never catch him with a flat tire. Wait, huh? of course! The lasso! Rope him up, Buster. One, two, three, go! Great, you did it! You caught Bandit. And here's Sheriff Otis. I'm sure he's really grateful. There, Bandit is in the jailhouse where he belongs. Oh wow, Sheriff Buster. What an exciting dream that was! Happy trails, Buster! Buster and Cozy Coop are playing in the park! There's Iggy the ice cream truck! Buster's going to grab some ice cream! But what's that? It's Robot Buster! He's turned yellow like Buster! Cozy thinks it's the real Buster and wants to play, but oh no! The ball hit Robot Switch, and it turned him mean! <laughs> robot Buster is leading Cozy away! Now Buster is back, but he doesn't know where Cozy went! Poor Buster! There's Iggy! What's Robot Buster up to? Oh no! He's throwing tomatoes at Iggy. That's very mean. Cozy looks very upset. Huh? 
Robot Buster is running away now. Poor Cozy doesn't understand. Meanwhile, Terry is playing the accordion. Nice. <laughs> oh no! Robot Buster smashed the accordion. Poor Terry. Cozy is standing up to Robot. That was really mean. But what's this? <laughs> it's Buster! Hooray! There's the good bad switch. Cozy knows what to do. <laughs> Flick! Now Robot Buster is nice again. Good job, Cozy and Buster. Now Robot Buster is making up for being mean. Iggy's all clean, and Terry's accordion is fixed. <laughs> Hooray! Here comes Buster the Bus. I wonder what he's going to get up to today. What's this? Look at that billboard, Buster. Those tires look so shiny and new. Maybe it's time for you to get some new tires, Buster. <laughs> Off he goes. Oh, look! It's Jessie the Jeep. She seems to be struggling up the hill. Here comes Buster. Poor Jessie. I think she needs some help, Buster. Her tires don't seem to be gripping the road. You're nearly there, Jessie. Keep trying. Oh, Buster, I know you want to get those tires, but your friend Jessie needs some help. Oh, no! Jessie is slipping back down. Aw, oh, well done, Buster! You came back to help Jessie. That was very kind of you. Oh, no! It looks like something is wrong with Jessie's trailer. It looks like the weight of the trailer is pushing her down the hill too fast. She's lost control, Buster. Quickly, Buster, you have to help her. It'll be okay, Jessie. Buster isn't far behind. Good job, Buster. Keep in control of the trailer so it doesn't tip over. Oh, no. The garage is up ahead. She won't be able to slow down in time. Great idea, Buster. Use your brakes to slow down, Jessie. That was a close one. Well done, Buster! And look! It's the shiny new tires you came Yay! for! Oh, poor Jessie. Her tires look sore. Buster, I think there's someone who needs them more than you. That's right, Buster. Well done! <laughs> Jessie really needs some new tires. They look great, Jessie. You'll have no trouble pulling your trailer now. And driving up hills will be easy. <laughs> Bye, Buster. Bye, Jessie. Buster and his friends are having a great time camping in the woods with Daddy Bus. Daddy is making some spooky shadows as he tells them a ghost story. Whoa, that monster is super scary! Phew, don't worry, gang. It's only Daddy Bus. Looks like it's time for bed. Good night, everyone. Daddy Bus is off to collect some more firewood for the fire. Good night, Buster. Hang on. What is Buster up to? He's turning the firewood into scary antlers. Scout is fast asleep. Yikes! What is that? <gasps> it's Buster's scary shadow. Poor Scout! <laughs> Don't worry, Scout. It was only Buster. <laughs> now it's Bandit's turn to be pranked. Aha! The spooky shadow scared him as well. Looks like Buster is getting sleepy. But Bandit and Scout have a plan. Buster is sleeping peacefully. But there's a scary monster! And another one! Go, Buster, go! That serves Buster right. <laughs> Great job, gang. What is that? Oh, no! It's a real spooky monster! Phew! It was just Daddy Bus carrying back more firewood. That's enough scaring for one evening. All that joking around has made them very tired. 
It's Buster the Bus on a bright new morning. What's he going to do today? What's that? Seeds? Whoa! Buster's going to grow some fruits and vegetables. Buster heads to his vegetable patch and takes a look at the instructions. First, he needs to dig a hole to plant the seeds in. Buster starts digging. Oh dear, this could take a long time. But look, there's Diggly. He'll be able to help. Diggly's the best at digging, and he's always happy to help his friend. Diggly will have holes for the seeds dug in no time. There, no problem. Now Buster plants all the seeds in the holes and looks at step two. Sunshine. The seeds need sunshine to grow, but uh-oh, it's a cloudy day. But look, there's Monty, the hot air balloon. Maybe he can help. There, Monty's pushed the cloud away. Now the seeds are growing. Now, step three. Rain? Looks like another job for Monty. He's hopping on the cloud and perfect. Now they just have to wait for the seeds to grow. Many days pass. The plants get bigger. Then one bright morning, Buster checks his calendar. Today is the day! <laughs> Look! Red tomatoes, orange pumpkins, yellow sweet corn, green beans, and purple eggplants. Well done, Buster! Look at all the colorful fruit and vegetables he's grown. Now he can share them with his friends. <laughs> Look, it's Buster the Bus and Scout the Little Car. They're playing basketball together. Nice work, guys. Oh dear, Buster is very tired. It's been a long day. Now it's getting late. Time to go home and rest his sleepy head. Now Buster can sleep and dream the night away. What will he dream of tonight, I wonder? Oh, look! It's Twinkle, the star! She helps everyone sleep peacefully through until morning. Twinkle's going to give Buster sweet dreams. Whoa! Buster's a rocket in space! He can fly about through the stars and float through the night sky. Awesome! There's Twinkle again. They can explore space together. What fun! Look! There are some shooting stars. Whoa. And there are some big floating asteroids. I think Twinkle's playing hide and seek. There she is. Where's she leading Buster to now? Look, the moon. It's bright yellow. Buster is having so much fun playing out in space. Wow, it's Mars. The red planet. There's a little space buddy coming out to play. I think Buster's frightened, but it's okay. Space buddy just wants to make friends. Now they can bounce up and down together. Making new friends is the best. Buster's had such a fun time playing with Twinkle and space buddy, but now it's time to go back home to Earth. Buster's coming into land. Ah, Buster, what an amazing dream. Thanks, Twinkle. Good night. Buster, what are you doing? We are going to use this dress-up box to put on a play. <laughs> <laughs> this play is going to be about pirates, and I'm going to be Captain Busterbeard. Yar! This will be so much fun. I can do my juggling trick. Uh, maybe, so long as it's piratey. And I want to sing this new song I made up. It goes like this. <laughs> Who's the big bus? Oh, yeah. Uh, I'm bandit. The big bus. Pirates oh, yeah. don't sing. My pirate does. I can have lots of tentacles, <laughs> like giant squids. <laughs> A giant squid, Ash. You'll be great. Come on, guys, let's go. There's so much to do. <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually more into tractor jazz. We're ready! Oh? 
Yar! This is the story of Captain Busterbeard. <laughs> I'm the bravest pirate in the whole wide world. And I'm his best friend, the juggling pirate. <laughs> Look, what's that? It's another pirate. Not just any pirate. Mm -hmm. It is I, Bandit Beard the Singing Pirate. Bandit? Oh no, who's the big bus? Oh yeah, huh? I'm the big bus. Oh yeah, I'm a super huh? fast bus and I zoom, zoom, zoom. I'm the speediest Come on, Ash. bus in it's the room. It's your turn. Room. It's me, the giant skink. <laughs> Who's the big bird? Oh. <laughs> oh, this is a disaster. What are you talking about? The audience love it. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Ash. Time for the big finish. I'm too nervous. I'll do it wrong. You can do it, Ash. We're here to have fun. I don't want to do the play without you. I am the giant skid. squid. I am the giant squid. Look at all my tentacles. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! We're the big bus! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! That was great fun, Buster! Yeah, it was! It's Halloween, and Buster is having a party! <laughs> He's looking for a cool costume to make himself Ooh. super scary! What has he found? Whoa! Buster is dressed up as a cowboy! Awesome! Time to put this costume to the test! Boo! Buster tries to scare Mommy! Did it work? Hmm, maybe the cowboy costume isn't scary enough. He needs to find something scarier! Aha! He's got it! Arr! He's a pirate! This is going to be much scarier. Oops! Be careful, Buster! There's Grandpa Bus! Scare him, Buster! Arr! Oh dear! Buster is still not scary enough! But looks like he's got an idea. Hang on a second. Where has Grandpa's laundry gone? It's time for snacks. <laughs> what was that? There's a noise coming from that shed. But what is making that noise? It's a bit spooky. Wait a second, I recognize that giggle. It was Buster all along. That was definitely a scary costume. Sounds like people have arrived for the party. And Mommy has a plan. Ash and Scout have arrived. They're so excited. Hmm. There's nobody there. Whoa. They're a little oh. bit scared. <gasps> what is that? Mm. Boo! <gasps> ah! Run away! <laughs> Don't worry, Ash and Scout. It was just Buster. <laughs> what a great prank and a very scary <laughs> costume. Buster is so excited to go play with his best friend, Scout. 
What'll they play today? Ooh, Grandpa has a remote-controlled car! Buster's going to control it first. Vroom, vroom! Look at it go! Now Scout wants a go. But Buster wants to keep driving. Uh-oh, Scout doesn't think that's fair. She wants a turn. Oh dear. Now they're fighting over the remote. They both want to control the toy car. Oh no! The car crashed and broke! <gasps> now nobody can play with it. Buster and Scout are upset with each other. They're not playing anymore. It's so sad when friends argue. But wait, I think Grandpa has an idea. <laughs> He's giving the remote to Scout and the toy car to Buster. They'll need to work together to fix it. <laughs> oh, now they've made up. Oh. Friends always forgive each other. <laughs> there! Now they can both control the car. Buster and Mommy Bus are visiting Terry's farm today. <laughs> Wow, the farm is so cool. Buster is so excited. Oh, look, an adorable litter of puppies. How cute. Buster has spotted a soccer ball. He loves soccer. Mommy Bus is here to check that all the puppies are healthy, but Buster has other ideas. He wants to go and play some soccer on the farm. <laughs> what was that? One of the puppies followed Buster outside. Looks like she wants to play. Hmm, but Buster wants to play by himself. <laughs> there she is again! The puppy won't stop following him. Buster is throwing the puppy a stick to distract her. That will make her leave. Nope, that didn't work. And now the puppy has taken the soccer ball. What a cheeky little puppy! Aha! Finally, Buster got his ball back. But the puppy still wants to play. Stay there, puppy. Buster is hiding behind a stack of hay bales. <gasps> Not again! Maybe Buster can lose the puppy in the cornfield. The puppy is sad she can't find him. But Buster's plan worked. Oh no! How did that puppy get up there? She's going to fall! And Mommy Bus and Terry haven't noticed. Quick, Buster, quick! Go, Buster! Phew! He saved the puppy! That was a close one! Oh. Mommy Bus has noticed a puppy is missing. But don't worry, Buster has brought her home. Oh. <laughs> what a fun day at the farm! Uh-oh, not again! Oh. 
Whoa! Buster and his friends have been out trick-or-treating for Halloween. <laughs> Buster has lots of tasty sweets in his bucket. <laughs> Grandpa reminds Buster that he shouldn't eat too many sweets at once. Now Buster's up in his room. But now, no one is watching. He's eating all the sweets he can. Ouch! That really hurt! Oh no! Buster has a wobbly tooth! That's really frightening! Mommy's come to fetch Buster. It's dinner time! But he's hiding his wobbly tooth. I don't think he wants anyone to know. <laughs> Dinner's ready. Lots of tasty vegetables. But Buster doesn't want to eat. Mommy can tell something has upset Buster. He's showing her his wobbly tooth. Aww. Grandpa knows what to do. He tells Buster to take a bite of that sweet corn. Look! Buster's tooth has fallen out! That wasn't so bad! Buster feels much better now! Now it's time for bed! Mommy tells Buster to put the tooth under his pillow. Whilst he's asleep, the tooth fairy will come to collect it. Buster wakes up the next morning and... Whoa! A big gold star! Buster is going to wear that proudly. Now he knows there's nothing to worry about with a wobbly tooth. I think Buster is sleeping again. Where are you, Buster? Look at all the giant colored balls and toys. It looks like a great place for an adventure. Let's see what else Buster can find. Wow! Look at that teddy bear. Look how big it is. He looks soft and cuddly. Ooh. Aw, that's it, Buster. Have a nice big cuddle. Ooh. He looks so cuddly. Oh no, Buster. What's that noise? It's a giant claw. Huh? I think Buster is inside a giant claw machine. Buster, watch out. It's going to get you. Ah! Go, Buster. Oh no. Ah! <gasps> Phew. Buster, it was just a bad dream. Look, it's Scout. It looks like Buster is still a bit shaken up. But you don't need to worry anymore, Buster. Look, Buster. Scout has something to show you. I wonder what it is. Oh no, it's a claw machine. Buster looks frightened. Scout's not scared of it. Maybe it's fun. Don't worry, Buster. Scout's with you. <gasps> Look, Buster. It's that teddy. Why don't you try and win it? Come on, Buster. Just be brave. You can do it. Okay, Buster. Let's get this teddy. Take it easy. That looks about right. Okay, here goes. <laughs> Did you get it? <laughs> huh? What's that? Oh, it's a little yellow bus. That toy looks just like you, Buster. Huh? <laughs> that makes Scout and Buster laugh. Buster has gotten over his fear of the claw machine now. It's a windy day at the park. Buster and Daddy Bus are here for a fun day out. Daddy Bus has a surprise for Buster. What could it be? Oh, look! It's a kite! Buster gets ready to fly it. Daddy Bus pushes it up into the air. Wow! It's flying so high! Well done, Buster! Look! It's Monty, the hot air balloon! Oh no! A big gust of wind has blown the kite away! It's caught on Monty, and he hasn't noticed! Don't worry, Buster! Daddy has a plan! Oops! Watch out, Daddy Bus! Whoa! Great header! Go, Buster! Bandit and Ash look very confused. Where are they going? Buster is trying to get Monty's attention. But he's not looking where he's going. Watch out! 
Oh no! Buster has driven straight into a muddy puddle. He's stuck in the mud. Daddy heaves him out. Great teamwork, guys. Uh-oh, a tree has fallen across the road. But that won't stop them. Daddy Bus flies right over the log. And Buster slides straight underneath. Wow, that was awesome. Quick, there's Monty. Looks like Daddy Bus has an idea. There's a huge pile of mud and they're splashing through it. What are they doing? They've drawn a picture of their kite in the mud and Monty has finally noticed the kite oh. wrapped around him. Oops! <laughs> Buster gets his kite back. Ah. Thank you, Monty. Hold tight, Buster. Phew, that was a close one. Buster. And Digger, too. <laughs> That's a big sand castle you've built there. It's Sandy Seagull. Watch out, Sandy. Don't stand on the sand castle or you'll... Oh, dear. Poor Digger and Buster. Off you go, Sandy. <laughs> Cheeky bird. <gasps> what have you seen, Buster? It's a red shape sticking out of the ground. I wonder what it is. Nice work, Digger. It's a triangle. Isn't that cool? And look, Sandy has found a yellow shape, too. <gasps> It's a circle. Can you find any more, Sandy? Huh? Here's another one. This one's blue. Dig it out, quick. That's a square. It has four sides. Whoa, there are so many shapes. Triangles, circles, rectangles, hexagons. Sandy, wait, don't. Oh dear, oh dear. Wait a minute. I think Buster has an idea. Buster and Digger are collecting the shapes up. I wonder what they're going to do with them. They're stacking them up. I think they're building a tower. Just one more piece to go on the top. That's it, Buster. Gently, gently. There. Perfect. Wow, Buster and Digger have made a tower out of the shapes. What a great idea. Now they can get back to building their sand castle. And look, Sandy has somewhere to stand that won't collapse. Nice work, Buster. Bye, Buster. Bye, Digger. Gather around and hear the fairy tale of Buster the Wizard. There's Buster the Bus. Looks like he's driving through the enchanted forest. But wait, what's this by the road? I think it's a spell book. Wow, Buster can use that to do magic. Look, it's Scout, Terry, and Jesse in the town square. I think Buster's going to try casting some spells. Let's see now. Whoa, a wizard's hat. Buster really is doing magic. I wonder what spell Buster can use to help Terry. Abracadabra. Wow, Buster made the plants grow. Nice work, wizard Buster. What other spells are in the spell book? The bee spell? Oh, look, Buster turned Scout into a bee. She's having so much fun flying around. I think Jessie wants to fly too. What spells are there for that? Bubbles. Cool, Jessie's floating around in her own bubble. Nice work, Wizard Buster. Oh, look, he's very sleepy. Time for a nap, Buster. Uh-oh, I think something's gone wrong. The magic is out of control. Quick, Buster, you've got to put everything back to normal. Hurry, Buster. Phew, all the spells are canceled. But I don't think Buster's friends are very happy with him. 
Buster's putting the spellbook back where he found it. And that's the end of the fairy tale of Buster the Wizard. Buster, Ash, and Mira are playing hide and seek tag in the soft play area. There's Buster hiding in the ball pit. Ash has found him. Now Ash is trying to tag Buster. Quick, Buster, Ash is right behind you. Oops, looks like you found Mira. Tag, well done, Ash, you got him. There's Daddy Bus. He says it's time to go. But Buster, Ash, and Amira don't want to leave yet. Looks like they have a plan. Run! And the game is on. Daddy Bus is trying to catch Buster, but Buster is too quick. Almost. Oh no! Daddy Bus has crashed into the ball pit. It's the perfect time to find somewhere to hide. Where should they go? Oh, Mira has found a place behind the play blocks. Buster has seen a space behind the slide. But Ash is already there. Quick, Buster, quick! Daddy Bus is back on the hunt for them. Now where is Buster? There he is! But Daddy Bus hasn't seen him yet. Daddy Bus spots some wheels by the play blocks. Hmm, who could it be? It's Mira! Well found, Daddy Bus. Now where could the others be? What was that moving behind the slide? Boo! There's Ash! But where's Buster? There he is, hiding behind the tunnel. Looks like he has an idea to distract Daddy Bus. <gasps> What's that? A bouncy ball. Daddy Bus is going to investigate. Now Buster can find a new hiding spot. That's very sneaky. <laughs> Maybe Buster can use that trampoline to help him hide. Hmm, Daddy Bus still can't find Buster anywhere. He's found a new hiding spot in the ball pit. Oh well, Daddy Bus, Ash and Mira decide that it's time to go. Oh no, did they leave without Buster? We found you! That was very sneaky. Well done, guys! Now it's really time to go. What a fun day! It's the end of school, and it's time for Scout to return the school flower that she'd been taking care of. Now whose turn is it to take it home and care for it? Hooray! It's Buster's turn! Buster is going really slowly. He wants to make sure he takes good care of the flower. It's time to say goodbye to Scout and Ash. Whoa, careful, Buster. That was a close one. Buster is so happy to be caring for the flower that he's drawn a picture of it. He's even brought it to dinner. <laughs> I don't think it eats carrots, Buster. It needs water instead to make sure it grows strong. But now it's time for bed. Good night, flower. The next morning, Buster is super excited for school. Careful, Buster, you don't want to knock the flower. Oh no! The flower has smashed. What is Buster doing? He's hiding it because he's afraid he'll get in trouble. Hmm, Buster is pretending to be ill. But he doesn't have a temperature. Oh, now Mommy understands. Buster doesn't want to go to school with the smashed flower. He thinks he's let everyone down. But Mommy knows what to do. They'll put the flower in a brand new pot. It looks even better than before. There, good as new. Buster returns the flower to class. Everyone is really impressed with its lovely new pot. Good job, Buster. Now it's Ash's turn to take care of it. 
Hooray! I wonder what Buster's going to learn at school today. Oh, a volcano! Wow! <laughs> They're going to do an experiment. The teacher is showing them what to do. First, a drop of white powder. Then three drops of food coloring. Then some vinegar to make it all bubbly. Wow! It looks like an erupting volcano! Isn't that amazing? Everyone is so excited. They're going to do the experiment all by themselves. What a mess! It looks like Bandit didn't do it right. Oh no! Scouts didn't go right either. Maybe Buster? Buster has made just as much mess as the others. Why isn't it working? Can Ash get it right? Buster is going to check. Ash is still putting ingredients in. Whoa! It worked! Nice work, Ash! But how did Ash get it right when everyone else's went wrong? Oh, he followed the instructions on the board. What a good idea. The teacher is proud of Ash. Now the others are going to try again. But first, they check what they need to do. One drop of white powder. Then three drops of food coloring. Then some vinegar to make it all bubbly. Hooray! It's working! The volcanoes are all bubbling over. Don't they look great? Good job, everyone! It's amazing what you can do when you follow the instructions. The teacher is so proud of everyone. It's a sunny day at Buster's house. Oh, look! Mommy Bus is helping a kitten with a sore leg. There, all fixed and bandaged up. Scout is here to drive to school with Buster. They are playing in the playground. Oh dear! Scout hurt her tire. Buster's got an idea. What is he up to? He's bandaged up Scout's tire with toilet roll. All fixed! Great work, Buster! Looks like Ash wants to be bandaged up as well. And now Scout wants her other tires bandaged up. But Buster is all out of toilet roll. Bandit has a cheeky idea. They're all taking the toilet roll. They're getting the toilet roll everywhere. This looks very messy. They're getting a bit carried away. Oh dear, they've covered the playground in toilet roll. Teacher doesn't seem very pleased. <laughs> Mommy Bus is here to take Buster home. She wonders what has upset the teacher. Buster explains he was trying to help Scout like Mommy helped the kitten. Mommy will be able to bandage it properly. Time to get properly fixed up. Buster, Bandit, and Mira are outside playing with their soccer ball. Daddy Bus is fishing. <sighs> he hasn't caught any fish yet. Buster has some great skills. Whoa, and so does Mira. That's a big kick, Bandit. Watch out, Mira. Oh no, the ball knocked Mira's hat off. Where did it go? It's not over here. It's definitely not over there. Mira is upset that her favorite hat is missing. Don't worry, Mira. We'll help you find it. Buster has an idea. We can look for the hat using our imagination. 
Now we can turn the search into a fun game. Off they go. It's time to look for that hat. Whoa, those are very big footprints. They decide to follow them and see where they go. <laughs> Stop! What's that up ahead? <gasps> it's a dinosaur! And he's wearing Mira's hat! Uh-oh! Run! They're going as fast as they can, but the dinosaur isn't far behind. And Buster spots a big volcano up ahead. They've got to get over that puddle. Buster and Mira make it, but oh no! Bandit gets stuck! Buster is trying to help Bandit get out. <gasps> Uh-oh! The dinosaur caught up with them! He looks very scary! But what's the dinosaur doing? He's seen his reflection! And I think he likes the hat. But that's Mira's hat, and she wants it back. Looks like she has an idea. <laughs> wow! Nice shot, Mira! The ball knocked the hat right off! Oh no! But looks like the hat is flying straight towards the volcano! How are they going to get it back now? Buster can do it using his imagination. It's Super Buster! Off he flies to save the hat! It's getting closer and closer to the volcano. He needs to be quick. Go, Buster! He got it! <laughs> Thanks, Buster. You're a great friend. <laughs> they played a fun game, and Mira got her favorite hat back. <laughs> Everything is more fun when you use your imagination. take a long time, though. But it's worth it. Only the best for my best friend. Uh, Buster. Maybe I'll be a mechanic someday. Buster! Oops. <laughs> Sorry, Scout. I promise my painting will be better. Painting? But we've just come from the car wash. Oh, double oops. That was a surprise, too. Come on. Uh... Everything okay, mm. Buster? Um, yup. <gasps> oh no! I've used the wrong colours. I just wanted to make you feel special on your birthday. Now I've messed it all up. I'm sorry. Don't be sorry. I've had the best day! This is so much fun! It is? Of course! What could be more fun than messing around in the <laughs> garage with my best friend? Woohoo! But we were supposed to have a photo. Not yet. I've got a great idea. Buster, it's time for a makeover. Hmm, not like buses to be late. <gasps> Ready, Diggly? Sure. You look super. 
super cool. Hello, Buster. It looks like you're having fun splashing through the muddy puddles. You're getting mud everywhere. And who's this? It's Terry Tractor. He's being a little more careful than Buster. Buster is having so much fun zooming through all these puddles. Oh no, he's heading straight for Terry Tractor. Phew, that was a close one. Be careful, Buster. The puddles are very slippy. Oh dear, Terry Tractor is not happy with Buster. Off he goes again. Watch where you're going this time, Buster. <laughs> Watch out! Oh no! Buster is stuck! Silly Buster. What's he going to do now? The sun's going down, and it's getting dark. I hope Buster is going to be okay. Look, everyone! It's Terry Tractor! He's come to save the day! Terry doesn't look too happy about it, though. Please help Buster, Terry. He just needs one big push. Can he do it? One, two, here we go! Hooray! Thanks, Terry. Oh, Buster. Thank goodness Terry Tractor was there to save the day. Bye, Terry. Bye, Buster. Look. Buster and Cozy Coop are playing in the park. There's Iggy, the ice cream truck. Buster's going to grab some ice cream. But what's that? It's Robot Buster. He's turned yellow like Buster. Cozy thinks it's the real Buster and wants to play. But oh no! The ball hit Robot Switch and it turned him mean. <laughs> Robot Buster is leading Cozy away. Now Buster is back, but he doesn't know where Cozy went. Poor Buster. There's Iggy. What's Robot Buster up to? Oh no! He's throwing tomatoes at Iggy. That's very mean. Cozy looks very upset. Robot Buster is running away now. Poor Cozy doesn't understand. Meanwhile, Terry is playing the accordion. Nice. <laughs> oh no! Robot Buster smashed the accordion. Poor Terry. Cozy is standing up to Robot. That was really mean. But what's this? It's Buster! Hooray! There's the good-bad switch. Cozy knows what to do. <laughs> Flick! Now Robot Buster is nice again. Good job, Cozy and Buster. Now Robot Buster is making up for being mean. Iggy's all clean and Terry's accordion is fixed. <laughs> Hooray!